Okay, so let's recap what we've done here. This was the project for the weekend. This is uh, the Labor Day weekend 2018 and I wanted to fix the grass because there's nothing but crab grass in the median. So that's what I did. And the process was to, I killed off the crab grass in the very beginning. This was weeks ago. I used the uh, Roundup glyphosate, killed it off, waited a couple weeks, came back, and then I tilled it with a tiller. Honda 5 horsepower. I rented it. It worked really well, but there was a lot of rock. It was tough. It was really, really tough. So I got it all tilled, raked all the stone out, raked it and raked it and raked it and raked it. Got it looking pretty good. And then once I had it all raked, we actually had a torrential downpour yesterday, but I had packed the dirt down. I just ran my tractor over it, packed the dirt down. It seemed to do pretty well. The dirt didn't move around a whole lot. And then today I came back, loosened up the dirt again. I actually used my tractor and a uh, dethatcher, or a, a thatch rake on the back of my little tractor. Broke up the dirt again, then had a garden weasel. Used the garden weasel to really break up the dirt, get a nice top layer of fresh dirt up. And then once I had that done, I went ahead and seeded, fertilized, watered it real good. And then I put the uh, straw. This is supposed to be that sticky straw that's, I don't know, I won't blow around as much. We'll see. I don't expect anything from this stuff, but it's down, looks pretty good. So, now we wait and see what happens and for posterity this fert scott's turf builder with weed preventer it says it prevents crabgrass and dandelions for up to six weeks i've heard good things about this stuff we will find out if it's any good i think it'll work fine i've used scott's stuff before and that's the crabgrass preventer and it's worked fairly well so we will see, yeah, there's the straw. Easy straw, CD mulch with tack. So we'll see how tacky it stays down. It did make my hands sticky. Uh, I mean, it was definitely, definitely tacky on my hands after applying it. And then finally we will take a look at the seed. Jonathan Green. Black Beauty grass seed. This is pretty nice, pretty nice grass seed. On it, so it's tall fescue, three different types. And then one of the most important parts right there is that little date. This is the freshest bag I could find. So I put her down. And we'll come back in a week or so and see how it's doing.
fixing the median. This was all crabgrass. There's a nice big pile. There's the boo. Another pile of garbage. Another pile of garbage. More dirt. Got some good dirt in the back. Threw it down. Did some tilling. Got everything mixed in. And now I'm just raking everything level. quite rocky first thing I did was killed all the crab grass with um, Roundup let it go for a couple weeks and then now put the better dirt down tilt it in and smooth it out hopefully in six weeks we'll have nice grass What do you have to say for yourself? <laughs>